What are you going to do today, Sense? I think I'm going to make a new app for playing robot slayers on my smartphone. Whatever! What are you going to do, Susie? I'm going to have Coinsworth drive me over to the mall. I want to see if they have any new pink shoes. Why don't you take public transportation to go shopping? It's better for the planet. Because I have coins for it. Well, excuse me. What about you, Barry? Fred and I are going skateboarding over at the Black Zone. We saw some really cool ramps near the loading docks. Barry, that's a dangerous place to go. Who knows what you might run into over there. I know. Isn't that cool? As soon as Fred shows up, we're going to go check it out. Just be careful, Barry. You know that Fred always gets you into trouble when you go exploring places like that. Don't worry, Sense. We can take care of ourselves. What about you, Penny? What will you be doing today? I don't know much about writing apps for smartphones, but I sure can help Sense with marketing. If this app is as good as his last one, we can make a lot of money. Hmm... Interesting. It figures. Penny and Sense together again. You two have such a vivid imagination. Hey, Barry. Did you know the festivals are giving a free concert later today? Really? Where? They will be at the Luxuria Mall at noon. Wow. The mall is sure going to be packed with your fans. Hmm. Oh, look. Here comes that no-good Fred bro. Hey, Barry. You ready? I don't know, Fred. The Feasty Fools are going to do a free concert at the mall today. Oh, those guys are overrated. I'd rather take my chances over at the Black Zone. Come on! I'm not sure, Fred. That concert might be really awesome. Okay, I'm off to the mall. The mall is going to be packed soon. I know! They will all be watching the concert! I have all the stores to myself! Bye! Are you ready to work on that app, Penny? Yep. There's no time to waste. I just had a great idea for marketing your new app. Interesting. Do you two enjoy the concert? We didn't see the concert. Oh, why not? It was a good performance. Even I enjoyed it. The Feasty Fools make a lot of money. Penny and I were at my house working on an app for my smartphone. I like the Feasty Fools, but working on the app was more interesting. And I was working on a marketing scheme to sell the app. So, you gave up the concert in order to make money? Yep. That's why it's referred to as opportunity cost. Interesting. Tell us more. Well, we usually have a couple of choices of what we are going to do at any given time. The thing we don't do is the opportunity cost. What we gave up in order to do something else. So the cost of working on the app and making money was that we didn't get to go to see the concert. That's right. You could have gone to the concert. But then your opportunity cost would have been... Not working on the app. My plan was to sell the app to people as they leave the concert. Originally, I was going to make an app for playing Robot Slayers. But we decided that if we made an app for downloading free festivals, videos and music, we could sell it here at the concert. That's a great idea. You had a marketplace for selling a product and a large crowd of customers whom you already knew like the Fisty Fools. Hey, look! There's Barry! I hear everyone talking. They say the concert was amazing. Yes, it was a great performance. You didn't see it? No, Fred and I went over to the industrial park instead. We just started to explore some of the cool ramps over there when the security guard stopped us. So you didn't get to skateboard and you missed the concert? Yes, I didn't get to do either one. So the opportunity cost to go skateboarding was that you missed the concert and didn't get to skateboard either. Sounds like your decision had a high opportunity cost. Look, here comes Susie. Wow, that was a great concert. <sighs> so I hear. So you watched the concert? Don't be silly, Sense. I went shopping. But I could hear the concert all over the mall. So if I understand this correctly, Susie had the choice of watching the concert and not shopping, or shopping and just hearing the concert. Her opportunity cost was that she didn't get to see them perform. But she did get to hear them. And I found these awesome shoes! I can go and see the Feasty Fools anytime I want. But finding the perfect pair of shoes is an experience better than any concert. In this 
this episode, students are exposed to something that they're confronted to every single day, making choices. Making good choices can be tough, especially when you have two very appealing choices. Opportunity cost teaches you that you can't have everything you want and that life is full of trade-offs. Understanding opportunity cost helps you to reflect on how the money choices that you make today can ultimately benefit you later on. Because of scarcity, any time a choice is made, there are alternatives that are not chosen. More precisely, there is always the next best alternative that is not chosen. It is important that you recognize and evaluate opportunity costs when making decisions. Make good choices for your future!